get it, man, I swear that she can get it, say it. guys welcome to or welcome back to my channel it is your girl in the Ryan's occasion here i am going to look different um i'm just recording my intro i forgot to do it um but nonetheless um i'm just going to be doing a simple twist out this is the spoiler alert this is the outcome of it my hair is short she is growing it's going to be a journey it's going to be a real journey if you know you know it's going to be a real journey and i would love for you guys to come along with this journey with me to grow out my hair and take care of it my goal is to double it double the length by the end of this year because this is a year's worth of growth because i cut it off at the beginning of 2023 and it's 2024 now so this is a year worth of growth growth so i want to see if i can double it um to have a little hang time, you know what I mean? Anyway, any who's yeah, I just want you guys to enjoy the video. Um, it's gonna be a few voiceovers. Don't worry about that. Just enjoy the video. Subscribe, like, comment, share it with a friend, or share it with somebody that's into this content. And if you're into this content, welcome to the family. You might as well just subscribe. It's, it's all good vibes over here. It's all good vibes. So enjoy the content. Hey guys, so it's your girl Naraya here and I'm back. Right now I'm coming in with the scissors and I'm cutting my braids off. Everybody knows the one-two of how to cut your braids. I don't need to reiterate this. I'm just cutting it down. Um, I don't want to get ahead of myself, but it was to a point where I cut it down and I kind of wanted it to be a bob. But then I was talking to my roommate and she was like, you can do that as long as you retwist your roots, like redo your roots. I'm not doing all of that. I'm not doing all of that. So I decided to just take them out. As you can see right here, this is where I wanted to kind of put it into like a bob style. I, it kind of gave, um, damn, hold up. It was giving um, Libby from Jimmy Neutron. I always wanted her bob braids. She, I feel like she was eating them down um, at that time. So it, it was giving that. I was feeling that, okay? So I'm here now taking out my braids. I was watching Club Shay Shay. Um, interviewing Cat Williams. If you guys know, you know. <laughs> I got the freaking way for that, but I was watching that. So, yeah. I am on my last braid. My hair is thick, thick with C's, not a K, it's with C's and an S. My hair is thick, my hair is coarse. I'm very grateful for the type of hair that I have, but um, yeah, I was dying to get this last braid out. I don't know if anybody ever, I'm pretty sure everybody that gets braids does this, that has like added hair. When you cut your hair, when you cut the braid longer, even though your hair is not to that length, it's it's a for me it's a form of um, I guess you could say like hope or faith that my hair is that long. We're working on it. We're working on it. So this last braid is really struggling here. So I'm just taking this last braid out, and then the next clip will be me washing, and then 
I'll probably be officially talking by that time. So this voiceover is uh, going to be a little done. I'm about to peace out. So enjoy the rest of the video. Thank you. We are back. We are back. Um, I'm going to be washing my hair. I done took my hair out, as you guys seen in the first two clips. Um, I'm going to take. I'm going to wash my hair. My hair is really thick. She needs a wash. Um, I have no idea what the hell I'm gonna do to my hair, but um, we're gonna see. We're gonna see. Um, so yeah. So I have the Oris. Um, shampoo, conditioner, um, the Moisture Restore Premium Auto Shampoo. I don't know if you guys can see it. There we go. And then I have the Strengthen and Nourish Replenish Conditioner in the scent of Sweet Orange Oil. This right here. These are good. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna place you guys here. I mean, I'll just come back when I'm done, honestly. I'll just come back when I'm done, honestly. Because this is a lot and I don't want to get my phone wet. So, yeah, so I'll see you guys when my hair is washed. And um, I'll come back when, it's, when I'm blowing it out, essentially, if I, blow, if I blow it out. I haven't decided just yet. It's going to be a long day. So, I'll see you guys. Okay. So I am back. My hair is washed. Um, jump scare. My hair is washed. I have to detangle it though. There's still like my hair sheds a lot. Um, my hair definitely sheds a lot. I think it's because of the blonde. And I don't like pulling it, but like. It sheds. This is how much like hair I done lost. That's like all the dead hair and stuff like that. I definitely need a trim. I haven't gotten a trim in a while, so that's probably why my hair is shedding. Um, so yeah, my curls are still there. Um, I think I'm gonna just do a twist out. I think I'm just do a twist out. Um, so yeah, I will get back to you guys when I have all my things ready. And we're gonna start that. So I'm not gonna blow dry it. I'm just gonna twist it out um, and stretch it out. So hopefully I have some length to it. If not, it's fine. It's fine. Shrinkage is real. So it's all part of the process, right? Right, okay. So yeah, so I'll hit you guys back when I am all set and ready to twist my hair out. My hair. Now we are going to get in the nitty gritty of it all. Um, don't want my phone to die, so I might charge it. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the As I Am Restore and Repair Jamaican Black Castor Oil Water. Plus my little water concoction that I mixed up is olive oil and tea tree oil in here with water. Shake this bad boy up. Spray it. It is warm water in here. I'm not waking conjugate in there i don't even know if that's the right word um then i also have the jamaican mango and lime black castor oil as well i have the eco style professional styling gel olive oil shea butter with black castor oil and flat seed which is black castor oil up over here i have the as i am classic buttercream this is with cocoa butter, shea butter, castor oil, Jehovah oil, and sugar beet root. That's good. This, this is my friend products. You know, so I'm just borrowing her stuff. It smells good though. Hopefully it gives me a nice juicy curl. This one is Mazani. I never used this before. It is a... Um pre or restyling spray. So I'll probably spray this after I'm done to give them a nice, you know, um, what is the word that I'm looking for? A nice, um, I don't know, a nice spray. I don't know. Then I have the Miel, the Miel, 
Mio. I think it's a, that's what it's called. The pomegranate honey oil coating custard. That smells really good. That smells really good. Then I have, it's a 10 um, Miracle Silk Soothing Balm. This has a whole bunch of stuff. It's a heat protected. It cuts down in drying time. Usually I use this as a blow drying thing. Um, yes. But I like how silky it is in my hand. So I'm just going to use a little bit because it is technically for when you blow dry um, and do like silk pressing and stuff to give you that silky feel. And then I have my intense hydrating oil. I'm running low on this thing. I have to re-up on it. This right here is my holy grail. The Gold Series by Pantene. They knew what they was doing when they made this gold series. I just, I just, they knew what they was doing when they made this gold series. So, that is what I have. This doesn't have nothing to do with it, but I'm putting on my freaking Nivea um, chapstick because, you know, it's winter. You got to keep them smooth, okay? So, that's what I'm going to do. I'll come back to you guys when it's, like, halfway done because I have to let my phone charge. So, those are my products. And I'll see you guys. All right, so we're back. I done did all the quadrants of my hair. Turn it back so you guys can see. So now we only have this part. I just don't like how this part is kind of like sticking out. So maybe I have to put like a clip to just like have it down. I don't like the sticking out part. Um. Oh. So I just have this much to go. I did this quite fast, honestly. It only took me like two hours. And the only reason why I know this is because I'm currently watching like Cat Williams interview with uh, Shannon Sharp. So um, yeah, that's how I know it's two hours and 17 minutes and 51 seconds. <laughs> but anyway, nonetheless. So how I did it, how I got my um, curls to be my twist to be juicy and whatnot, you know what I mean? Um, I took my concoction that I talked about earlier with my warm water and my tea tree oil and my olive oil. Took that, sprayed it. Cause my hair, my hair loves to drink water. She's, she's, like she loves to drink water. Um, so I just have to make sure that not only she has enough water to drink, I have enough water to work with. So <laughs> I'm just gonna spray her. Spray the roots as well. And I don't wanna drip it on my face, so I just want my hair to be like wet. I don't want the water to drip on my face because that's not fun. work it in there and then I'm going to take the as I am restore and repair Jamaican black castor oil water and spray that on top spray that on my roots work that in there as well see it's dripping I don't like that don't like that. Then I take the Jamaican black castor oil. This one. Hopefully you guys can see. It's not focused. Hey. There we go. I take that. Pour some in here. In my palm. Dripping on the side of my face. I take a um I take a little bit of this. It's a 10. Um, Miracle Silk Soothing Balm. Like I said, this is really for blow drying, but it has a leave-in conditioner um, in it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So, that's what I use. I use that. Put that in there.
I have to be real, like, um, quite nice with my edges because they hurt. Like, they hurt really bad. Because I've been doing them when I have braids. I've been pulling my hair up in a freaking, like, bun and everything. So, it hurts really badly. So, then, I take the I Am Double Buttercream. Two fingers. Just like this. Palm. And just work that all the way through. When I did it over here, I did it section by section, which is not bad. Um, it's just, it's not my stuff, so I don't want to use all of it. No, because hair products is, uh, it's, it's pretty, uh, you know, expensive. So, yeah, very expensive. Make sure I get it on the ends of the hair. Especially because my hair has blonde um, tips and stuff. So definitely get it on the ends. And then I take the Miele um, Curl Custard. Two fingers. Palm like this. This is where the magic happens. Take the gel and I mix them together in my palm. To know that, um, like, if you're going to use two separate, um, what's it called, products and they're not by the same company, you want to make sure that they mix together. And how you know is it's, it's a, like, it's all cohesive. Like, it mixes together pretty well. Like, for something not to mix together, it will clump. The ingredients aren't, um, what's the word? I'm gonna put it on screen. The, the ingredients aren't, aren't coming together like you, will, like you will want them to. So you want them to come together like this. So if y'all can like see my hand come together like that. So I just put that all throughout my roots. My ends, definitely. Take it, I'm going to use my mirror. I go from my eyebrow, where my eyebrow arches up. And kind of want to clean a clean part. So the front always have to be clean. Uh whatever's going in the back of me is none of my business because I can't see it. So the front though, it has to be has to be on point. So now I finger comb to like separate every separate everything. And I do go back in with another set of the custard and the gel, but just like a smaller amount. Cause I want that slip. I want that slip, like. Like when I do this, like my hair should curl. You guys can't really see it cause it's not focusing, but. I want my hair to curl. I take a take a part with my finger. I don't know the measurements. I just take a part with my finger, and I twist down. I haven't mastered the three uh, the three strand strand. Jesus, the three strand twist. I haven't mastered that just yet. I'm gonna wait till my hair gets a little longer, um, to try it out once again. I'm
I am back guys I hope you guys miss me um it's very silent and I was gonna find some music to put over this and or cut it down but I didn't feel like doing either I felt like doing a voiceover um I know I said I was done I just want to get in here before I talk which I'm about to talk soon um let me know when you guys want this is basically the end of the video let me go let me know when you guys want in a video q a when not story time and stuff like that i got some stories they're they're not dramatic my life wasn't that extravagant hey i have a lot of sad stories i don't want to get into that we'll get into that later on but that's yeah that's pretty much i just kind of want to in put my voice in this thing over here because it's it's pretty long and it's pretty silent and I'm pretty lazy to cut it down because I wanted the footage. So, hopefully I'm talking again because I am running out of words here. Running out of words. So, yeah. <laughs> anyway. Alright, so I'm going to use the Mazzani Cocoa Dew for curls that feels moisturized. So it's, it's a spray with coconut extract. It smells good. I'm gonna spray it. Just just for a little judge, a little more moisture for my hair to just suck in. I think I'm gonna seal all this moisture with some oil. And I want my hair to stay moisturized while they're in their twists. my hands and there you have it my hair is done it only took me two hours which is a breaking freaking record in my opinion breaking record anyway so i was please put on your bonnet put on your bonnet put on your bonnet when you go to bed put on your bonnet when you go to bed put on your bonnet when you go to bed wait if you ain't got no silk or satin pillow, put on your bonnet when you go to bed. Anyway, that's my bonnet. Um, so yeah, but like I was saying earlier, I'm going on a journey with um growing my hair. It's going to be a journey. Um, I did have long hair. I'll probably put pictures up if I can find them. Um, it wasn't long, long, but it was definitely longer than what it is now. Um, but for the past two years, three, for the past three years, 2020, 2021, 2022, and the beginning of 2023, I've been cutting off my hair at the beginning of the year. Um, so... I don't want to cut off my hair. I feel like I'm in a good space mentally to not cut off my hair anymore. Um, so the last time I cut off my hair was January of 2023. So this is the growth of a year. I want to see if I can double this by the end of 2024, by the end of this year. So you guys will be on the journey with me. The good, bad, the good, bad, and the freaking ugly. Um, so... Yes, yeah, so I thank you guys for watching. If you have gotten this far, um, 
thanks i don't really have anything to say but if you got this far and you watched and you enjoyed it thanks leave a like comment um and also subscribe it does help the girl out if you want to see more content like this let me know my socials is the narai jacasia i hope it's the narai jacasia or it's narai jacasia i'll put it on the screen as well as my tiktok i'll also put on the screen and the link below for you to guys go see it's not on my Instagram, but it will be there soon. So just for moral support at this current moment, follow your girl, please. I'm I, I'm I'm working on it. I'm working on it. <laughs> so other than that, I wish everybody a happy new year and there are going to be new things to come. So hugs and kisses, peace and blessings. Bye. You never gotta say shit, ooh. and I know you taste this a little bit. Mm, high maintenance, ooh. everybody else basic. You live life on an everyday basis.